10 frames needed to become champion. We're in for some night here. Neil Robertson can't afford to dwell on a few missed opportunities. He has to focus on what's ahead. He's playing. He's going to try and play gently here. Just got to be careful. Oh, he's going to miss the pack. And if it goes past the pink, he's going to be on a red. Wow. Well, yes. what, what an error of judgment. What a chance for Ronnie O'Sullivan. One. Oh, he saw the shake of the head from Ronnie O'Sullivan. Wanted to be top side of the blue, but it's gone too far to try and play off this top cushion. Playing the blue into the bottom corner. No. Chance missed. Ronnie O'Sullivan, one. One. Seven. And yeah, it's a bit of a shaky Neil start, Robinson. this. Seven. Well, Ronnie will attempt this right up into the green pocket. I'm just wondering, will Neil attempt a double here? The red just above the black. Could play the safety, but it's a free shot for the double. One free shot and it could turn into something much more than that. And he's got a nice angle on the black if he wishes to go into the pack of reds. Nine. Yeah, Ronnie be so disappointed. Haven't been given a, a very relatively easy chance. Fifty. Not to have carried on from this afternoon particularly that last frame we talked about. 60. Could have put Neil under a bit more pressure. 22. 30. 31. I think this first frame was certainly more important for Neil Robertson to eradicate those demons from this afternoon. 38. 39. 48 points in the lead, so still a lot of points on the table and a lot of safe reds. 46. One more loose red after this one. 47. He was in early, missed that blue. Try and get behind the red. Oh, that's worked out okay. You certainly on the 53. red into the right corner. 54. This is the shot now because he needs one more red. Yeah, I think this red is close to the bottom left corner pocket. That's the one he'd like to get on. It's easy to reach for a left hander. It's okay. It's not too bad. Okay, he's going to need the extended rest. But as we know already from this final, that's not necessarily frame over. Neil Robertson, 59. And he won frame. that frame, needing two snookers this afternoon. He's staying in his seat, needing one. So Neil Robertson has won the opening frame of the final session. He needs Ronnie O'Sullivan, 5-4. Possible long red for Ronnie here. Black is not available. Long way away. Yeah, he did very well, in fact, to hang on this afternoon, but surely to win the title, he's going to have to improve tonight. Particularly after winning that. Well, as you see, another excellent long pot from Ronnie Robertson. Not going to attempt the brown, just roll in behind it. Neil Robertson won. No. He's looking at trying to nestle into the two reds around the black. Four cushions here. It's a good line, is it? Hard enough. I don't think it is. Good line, though. It'll go back. Foul. The miss. Neil Robertson, four. Great reception for both players. Came into the arena tonight. 
Now this looks a better pace. Yeah, good shot. Good play. Hello, Sullivan just pointing out the, the chalk mark on the red. Air of safety there, hitting the blue. He's left a chance, not easy to play this. A lot of left hand side. Yeah, wasn't left hand side, just made that part more difficult. Play on the pink into the left centre. Sure, you can play it into sort of. Right side of the pocket, just create the angle for the cue ball. Yeah, it's pretty good. One. Nicely played. Seven. Yeah, Robertson. Oh, no, surprising Seven. miss from there, Robertson. He's not going to attempt this red. Get away with one there. It's the Australian. <coughs> Ron Sullivan's game has to improve the long ball game to just get him in amongst them. His long pot success is right down to 30 odd percent. 5 for 15. 75% for Neil Robertson. Good chance if he plays the red above the black to knock the black into play. Cue ball looks pretty good if it gets. Well, oh, might have got the other side of the yellow. A bit short. At least the black is in the open now. One. <laughs> It wasn't an intended, but certainly he'll take it. Really needs a good 30. break. Frame when a break here, just to get his confidence Four. back up. He's only had one break over 50 in the so 90 break in frame seven. 22. Yeah, I think that's the, the great admirable thing that's been certainly on display in his game during this final is just how well he's competed. 28. It's a nice delicate little cannon on the red, just a hold for the pink. Thirty-five. Not exactly in line, but he should make it. Thirty-six. Mm. Good plan, but didn't want that kiss on the red. Cue ball has gone slightly astray. Needs a good part here. Ronnie O'Sullivan, 36. So once again, just as it was looking promising, he's broken down. There's the plan, but it wasn't on the black and it's left this awkward pink, which he's missed.
One. Played that well, but he's a bit close to this cushion for comfort. Not enough pace. Now can Eight. he cut this red in? Tricky one. Neil Robertson, eight. Neil Robertson he's had so many chances and hasn't put enough daylight between himself and Ronnie O'Sullivan that it could come back and affect them. Wow. He's making a lot Ronnie of errors, O'Sullivan. even though he is still one frame ahead, but he's making more errors in this match than he's made in all his matches to get to the final. That's better from Ronnie, a better long one. That'll make him feel better. Eight. 28 points in the lead. So he's going to need Nine. one of those safe reds. 16. 17. He's got to try and knock one of these reds, maybe towards this left centre pocket. Oh, wow. 24. Still in a commanding position though, 44 points and of course the green is safe. Yellow's pretty safe. Ronnie O'Sullivan, so. 24. I think it's worth Ronnie having a go with this red up into the green pocket. Maybe, let me see, now he's going to keep it tight. Just thought he might take it on because the other two reds were safe and he only needs one red. Yeah, see, in his interviews he's saying like all week he doesn't care, he's just playing for the fun of it. But you can see the way he's playing, he's still as competitive as ever and it's good to see. Nowhere near his best at the moment, but he's still involved. Will he take it on? One. Well, <laughs> this is no good. He needs something. At the moment, he can only tie. I'm trying to take, bring the green into play. Neil Robertson won. Take the blue on so you could still win. Even if he misses it, the reds are safe. Interesting choice of shot. One. What a pot. What a pot. So, black, red, black, and the colours, and it's a respot. Well, that's Neil Robertson's cue action at its best. Such a difficult shot off that side cushion, and to get that much power into the shot and top spin to get Eight. on the black, it's just exceptional. Well, maybe Nine. bringing that green out into play has given himself a chance, so. Sixteen. If you can get it just somewhere near the green pocket, gives himself a shot at the green. Hold on, the yellow is not finished yet. Hold on. Needs to travel. Ooh, it was on the way into the pocket. 16. Any more pace, and that would have dropped. But he's left it for Ronnie O'Sullivan. Well, what a relief it will be. Hold on. Where's it? Ooh. <laughs> so. That cue ball was going dangerously close to that corner pocket, wasn't it? Deep breath, Ken. It's <laughs> going to be a long night, possibly. Ronnie O'Sullivan, as I say, is sticking Five. with him. It might be sort of bits and pieces from him, but he's still very much, very much in this final, fighting hard. Nine. You know, free flow and big 
break snooker, but 14. it's still full of incidents and drama. Fantastic stuff. Just how we like it. 20. And his chance there, Robertson, to possibly force the respot. Yeah. Yeah. The Ronald takes the second frame of the evening and will level again. It's all square at five frames each. in all sorts of trouble there. One. Four. Five. It's gone too far. Ten. If he has an angle, he could stun off this top cushion and get on the black into the same pocket. 11. 11. He's actually 16 19. when he first turned professional. Certainly the most successful non-British snooker player has ever been. Gun barrel straight Q action. One of the best Q actions in the game. If not the best. Ronnie 30. spoke openly and often eulogised about his opponent's Q action and how good it is. He's a big admirer of it. He'll play a delicate little cannon into these two reds. It's okay. One of the greatest break builders the game has ever seen. 38. It was long pot and break building as part of... That's the one thing he hasn't done in the final, which has been surprised and has really scored and made any notable big breaks. His highest Fort. has only been 72. Might put that right in this frame. 41. 48. 49. 56. 57. A couple of seasons ago, he was taking his time around the 28 second average shot timer. Down. 64. When he plays well, I think he plays 23, 24 seconds. 65. This break has been pinpoint with his cue ball. 71. 78. Oh, this is a wonderful shot. What a shot he's played there to knock the red out. Beautiful. Is Neil Robertson making his move in this final? 93. It's not just moving ahead again, it's how he's done it. With a wonderful 94. break, he needs this black. And a very timely one for Neil Robertson. Yeah. It's more like it, isn't it? And we're waiting for fireworks to happen in this final. 103. An opening, aggressive safety shot put Ronnie right in trouble. And Ronnie O'Sullivan has been sat in his chair. Admiring this as the rest of us have as well. Ten. It's been exceptional. Yeah, he's looked really confident as well as he's as he's made it. More in line with how he's played to get to the final. 121. Well, brilliant break this. The black floats in. And we're in 28 from, the from, the from, the from, from Neil Robertson. That was very, very special. Is he making his move? Well, he's ahead again. It's 6-5. Remember, 10 required. We'll see. 
did look good though, didn't he, as he made that break, considering that O'Sullivan has stuck with him all day. Now, how can six-time world champion respond? Like that. Yeah. Exactly like that. And here's the cue ball to slow up, though. One. He may have it. Oh, he's unlucky there. Preferred to have it straight one into the right centre, but put it into this bottom right corner pocket. Get on that red above the black. It's there. And the cue ball is good too. Excellent shot from Ronnie O'Sullivan. Well, the traditional time Four, to end five. the year with a real classic. There hasn't been any massive breaks Eleven. apart from that last frame, of course, but still being very dramatic. Full of incidents. Lots of close frames. Twelve. Really entertain this wonderful crowd and in challenging times kept the tour going 20 27 28 now he's got to get enough pace on this cue ball to split this pack now how's your look Need a bit of luck always when you're going into the pack. And he has definitely settled for that. 35. How many times do we see it in our sport? One player starts scoring. It sort of gets the juices going at the other player as well. And he knows he has to step up to the mark. But it can happen the other way. As you say, 42. one player can inspire another. Forty-nine. Oh, hold on. It's just slightly gone wrong. Tricky. Red into the corner. Oh, has he missed it? Oh, yeah. 49. Didn't expect him to miss it, but it was tricky enough. One. Because O'Sullivan was just starting to look good, wasn't he there? Yeah. Eight. Nine. This would hurt immensely. 16. 17. Got the pot, but he's on a red into the same left center 23. pocket. 23. What sort of an angle has he got? It's okay. He's played that well. He's got a nice angle on the black. Mm, it's okay. 31. Thirty-two. Yeah, he knew that was in immediately. Big point in the match, this. You know, this would be a better break for Neil than the last one if he could steal the frame from this position. 37. Much more important. 38. 45. 46. 53, 54. So he needs yellow, green and brown. Just checking the scores. 63. 66. But he's taken them really well. 70. And he's just holding Ronnie O'Sullivan off. As Ken said, a really important 75. break. It's come after the century, but this a better one because it looked like it was O'Sullivan's frame. 81. A match full of incident, this. Has Neil Robertson made his move now? Neil Robertson. He follows the century with a terrific clearance of 88 to establish a two frame. Ronnie O'Sullivan said, you can only squeeze so much out of a lemon.
has he run out of juice? Or will he come good when it matters most? Uh, dead straight on that red with uh, no easy access to pink or black that's why he's looking at the top one that was a nice shot one six Seven. Eleven. Twelve. He found himself straight on that red again. But he left an angle 17. so he can stand across for the black here and that's a good shot 18 so far in this frame 20 he appears to be striking the ball sweeter I don't think he went and practiced so I'm sure when he walked out he just handed his cue to someone backstage to mind for Duration of the mid session interval. That's not bad. Forty one. Forty two. I think now he's forced to play on a red to the left middle. Keep all over where it is now, roughly. That kind of region. Forty nine. Fifty. Remarkably, 13 frames in, or that's only the second half century of the match. Well, that tells his own story. Could use another one here to just restore confidence. Anyway, that's another beautiful cannon, and I agree with you, Phil. This is the, the best he's looked all day. Been a good break, this. 66. Seventy-three, seventy-four, eighty-one, eighty-two. 74 well he can make 140 here 89 90 Century, no but a vast improvement on what has gone before O'Sullivan sticking with Robertson. 7 6. Was at an early stage, you knew it was going to slide along the cushion and into the pocket. Well, that's okay. Eight. 
bit early to say that there's a shift here, but certainly an improved O'Sullivan. Nine. It's what we've seen of him all week. Manipulating the balls into a strong positions as ever. Oh, that was a kick. That was horrible. Slowed the cue ball down, but not... 24. Irreversibly. 25. 32. 33. 40. 41. That's a very big target here. Played one earlier where he, he just slid off the bunch, which was un, not like O'Sullivan. And that was a good clean hit. And he's very unlucky, I think, there to go through them because he hit the pink full on. I think you played that shot again a few times. The cue will not go that one far Sullivan, through them. 46. Playing the shot to nothing pot here. A great shot. It's a good job for Sullivan's sake that it went in because he didn't get the... Bit more zest in his game, undoubtedly, from 7-5. Six. Seven. That really forced that to get Kubel out anywhere 14. into a... Position of strength, which he's managed. 50. 20. 21. That's effectively over. Robertson surely will carry yeah, on. Sullivan. That last shot especially was not up to a great deal. I mean, it should be seven all, but really... One. Things can go wrong. As we saw earlier in frame eight, which O'Sullivan won from two snookers. In the semi-finals, in frame four, Nine. Robertson scored 78 points and lost a frame. He could. Obviously, the red below the black is perfect for getting 70. snookers on. Twenty-four. Twenty-five. Thirty-two. Neil Robertson, thirty-two. That was going to be anywhere near hard enough to snooze it. 25. O'Sullivan wants two things here. One, to win the frame, obviously. Secondly, not to become embroiled in a really lengthy tactical duel. safe and still get two more snookers. Make it three. Five. Concession, I think. Ronnie O'Sullivan, six. And the frame. You're right, Neil. It was 2-2, two, two, it was 4-4, four, four, it was 5-5. Five, five. And now, would you believe it, it's 7-7. Seven, seven. No, 
had to play it on the thin side because he was right about the natural angle taking him towards that red on the right. Not attacking safety shots these, but just, just just getting down that awkward corner of the table a little more. Sullivan can probably get the heel back there. Certainly open things up, isn't it? Those two frames he won in fairly quick time has put, uh, put Robertson on the back foot a little. And that's a brilliant pop. Very easy to play the continuous safety into that corner. Sullivan didn't want to get bogged down by that. And that has not touched the sides. Five. Six. Eleven. Well, there's always the risk. And that was a positive shot, but the blue would have been easier up and down. 18. 19. 25. 26. So that is his overall mojo. 31. 32. <coughs> just felt that he'd been hanging on all day. 37. Thought process. And he launched what looks to be a very serious attack on this match now, rather than just staying in it, which he had been doing. Good red to get on with the black now coming into play. 44. 45. Uh, that was nicely played. That was a, taking the bottom red out of the equation. Running on the top one, freeing the black spot all 52. in one. 53. Match looks very different all of a sudden to what we saw a lot earlier. Less than a handful of pots away 60. from leading for the first time. 61. <laughs> 68. 69. A penny for his thoughts. 76. In control. Pretty much all day, but yeah. not anymore. Okay. So we 77. And the two remain seated. The imposter is on the motorway. The real Ronnie O'Sullivan is here. And he's in overdrive. And he's in front at 8-7. O'Sullivan's turned this match on its head. Winning the last three frames, Neil, in 29 minutes. As opposed to all day, it's been the other way around. And all of a sudden, the safety shots have started to go wrong. Well, he's lined this up two or three times, and he's kind of gone back to square one. He... It's also, I've just got a feeling, as you pointed out, Phil, that he's trying something different from 7-5. Now, I know he's pulling balls, which is different. But I mean the way he's walking into the shots. He's trying a different method, which he's plucked out of nowhere. That is a brilliant shot. That really is. And well, well on the cushion, hit it the back of six. in that place. Great shot. Seven. Fourteen. On the 
Lee's recovery blues 50. to bulk pockets or even to the middle pockets. So Sullivan's always been the very best in the business. And he didn't let me down there. Twenty. Twenty one. Twenty seven. It appears his concentration is, is better as well. Getting better as the the evening has gone on. Don't know why. 28. Happened again tonight, the first half a frame, he was struggling all over the place. 34. Reds are not lined up perfectly well somewhere where the pink is now. That general area would be, be okay. It's found a line to get on the left hand red, I think. 40. 41. Forty-nine. Well, Robertson has not bothered the ball in live play, has he, since they came back from the mid-session. He made 32 when he was attempting to take the Reds off the table and get the snookers. Fifty-five. Otherwise, he's been sitting there all the time. Fifty-six. Still playing. Simply brilliant snooker. Sixty-two. Sixty-three. Seventy. Seventy-one. Well, he did one more tournament in the last year 18 months since his world title Ronnie O'Sullivan 77 leaving everyone in suspense and he comes back to the table 1 realistically the frame is gone he's 69 behind with 51 on 8 Neil Robertson, eight, frame conceded, frame. Now, one of the sides, enough is enough. You know, when he was 75 down, I said about Ronnie O'Sullivan, he might be an hour from victory. Often getting the last frame that you need can prove a little bit more difficult. And he hasn't been winning as we know. He won anything since the World Championship in August of 2020. All those finals he's lost in. Here he is on the brink of ending that run. If he could win it in the same way, then it really would be something. Because he's been very stylish. Four frames in a row. Completely turned this match on his head. I guess why two session snooker long matches now exist for bursts like that. Let's have a look at something there. I think he must have played that shot. I mean, it wasn't an actual plan. It seemed to be two reds onto a, the edge of another one, but he definitely didn't apologise. Four. Five. No, it's no good at all for a number of reasons. Mm. 
And I'll be playing that, this, the black, but to do what? Thank you. One. A lot of cute power there. Fine. Six. Well, nearly to the last snooker final of the year. And what a send-off to 2021, regardless of who prevails. 11. 12. 19. 20. and stuff, but so is Robertson. 26. 32. 33. Well, it looks like he'll have to go into the red below and to the right of the black, as you can see there. Just managed to avoid it, but I think he might have played the little nudge on it, to be honest, because this is not ideal. 40. Playing on this red, missable. Oh, that's a good shot. 41. It's a good recovery there. 48. It's certainly more like it. The match has really sprung to life. And Robinson knowing that he had to all of a sudden match what O'Sullivan is doing. Started to do so here. 49. Getting into the mini cluster. Just one pot away. Thanks. 57. <laughs> 64. 65. Yes, it's not as if Robertson did a lot wrong in those frames he lost. He was just needing Sullivan something to go at. He got a fluke in one of the frames and made a few off it. Otherwise, very good opening pass. 73. 78. Neil Robertson. 78 and the frame. Wanted a century, but it was a, a secondary issue. The main thing was to stay in the match. 9-8. He wasn't confident on that one. That's why the cue ball ended up up the table. One. 
It was beneficial for Robertson to get the blue back on its spot and the Six. angle he knocked it in at. Seven. Oh, that was a missed cue. Yeah, I was Robertson. trying to get a little bit of bite Seven. on the cue ball there just to get it back to avoid hitting the red he was playing on. It's horrible. That is horrible. One. When he miscued, you heard the groan from Robertson instantly. If you don't play this game, you might never realise why he did it, but I know what he's doing. He, d he knows that naturally he could screw into the red he was playing on, but he wanted to really get some zip on it. So he obviously went a bit low. And he saw the rest, it was horrible. Four. Five. Well, his ability to play left handed might have come into Twelve. the equation. He's looking at that red down the cushion. <clears throat> Why don't he just gently nudge into play? 13. Eighteen. Nineteen. <coughs> Twenty four. Twenty five. Well, it could be a little key shot here. Gentle nudge. Well, he couldn't have played it better. Delightful cannon. Played with a lovely pace. 32. 41. Oh, I think he's interested in playing the pink here and just nudging reds again. Well, that's uh, worked out ever so well. Now then, press for another title. Rescheduled 2020 World Championships. Played mostly 48. behind closed doors. They'd like to see him lift another trophy. Fifty-six. Well, now he's got to watch himself here. Up by another cannon. And all the cannons have worked out really well. <laughs> like a different player to the one we saw earlier. Everything has clicked into gear. 63. It's in the white, yeah. Robertson must be wondering how did this get away? If this goes in, he's as good as home. Sixty-four. Keep concentrating. Yeah. Now the crowd know. O'Sullivan knows. We know. He's a champion again. Seventy-one. Seventy-two. Who'd have thought, Neil, when he lifted the UK Championship title a week short of his 18th birthday, twenty-eight years ago, that now. He's thirty-eighth the ranking tournament, Sullivan. and I'll tell you what: considering the way it was achieved for Ronnie O'Sullivan, that will be one of the most gratifying for large periods today. He never looked as though he got a chance of winning, but he did win in the end with inspiration when he counted. Yeah, yeah. Ronnie O'Sullivan, he's the World Grand Prix champion of 2021. <laughs>